Good day everyone, today we're going to be taking a closer look at this ASUS Tough Gaming B550 Plus Wi-Fi 2 motherboard. We'll open it up and show you what's in the box, we'll go over the motherboard itself and all of its components and go over some of the specs. Now if you do want to pick one of these up for yourself, they are linked below in the description or if you just want more information. So let's go ahead and dive right into it. So again, this is the ASUS Tough Gaming B550 Plus Wi-Fi 2 motherboard. It's designed for Ryzen CPUs and it's AMD Ryzen compatible with Ryzen 5000 series, 5000G series, 4000G series, and 3000 series desktop processors. Head on over to the ASUS website to find the full compatibility of CPUs. It's got Wi-Fi 6, it's Windows 11 ready, and it's also got ASUS Aura Sync and ARGB Gen 2 powered by or a sink. Let's go ahead and open this up. So in the box, you can see you've got the motherboard here. We'll have a look at that in a moment. Right here, it looks like we've got the antenna. So there's the antenna there. It comes with a little stand. It's got a nice long cord so you can pull the antenna right away from your PC and get great reception. So this is Wi-Fi 6 and it also has Bluetooth 5.2 built in as well. So that's the antenna there. We'll lift the motherboard out here and we'll have a closer look at that in a moment. So underneath here we've got a whole bunch of stuff. We've got our user guide. It also comes with a DVD here with all your drivers and everything on it. Most people I think will just download that from the website. We've got the motherboard technical updates. We've got ASUS web storage. We've got a whole bunch of decals there if you want to use those on your PC as well as a certificate of reliability. And we've also got some other stuff here. We've got a couple of pads for mounting your NVMe M.2 SSDs. There's also two standoffs in here for your NVMEs with two screws. There is two SATA cables. One has a 90 degree end on it and the other one is straight. As well as you've got your IO shield there as well. So um, it does not come with this installed on the motherboard. And now for the motherboard. And there it is there, the ASUS Tough Gaming B550 Plus Wi-Fi 2 motherboard. I really like the kind of gray and orange effects on here, a little kind of digital swoosh across the top of the motherboard. The ASUS Tough Gaming icons on here. Feels really well built. And this is a ATX motherboard. And that's what the back side looks like, that gray digital swoosh across there as well. Really liking this. Let's go ahead and check out some of the ports and go over some of the specs. Starting in the corner here, we've got a nice big heat sink, again with the Tough Gaming decal on it, and we've got our 8 plus 2 DR MOS power stages. Now up here, you're going to find your 8-pin CPU connector right here at the top. And coming across the top here, you're going to find your CPU fan, your CPU optional, as well as your RGB header 1. Now again, this has the AMD AM4 socket, and this again is compatible with 5000 series, 5000G, 4000G, and 3000 series desktop processors. But again, double check on the ASUS website for full compatibility. We've got our DIMM slots here. There's four of them. This is dual channel DDR4, and it can handle up to 128 gigabytes, and you can see it's color coded here, gray and black. We've got our 24 pin connector right here on the side, as well as our front USB 3.2 Gen 1. And then down here, we've got six SATA ports as well, right there. I'm not gonna go over every connector and port for you, but we'll go over most of them. So we've got spots for two NVMe M.2 drives here. They've got heat sinks on them. The first one here is a 64 gigabit per second. And the second one here is a 32 gigabit per second. We've got a PCIe 4.0 by 16 port here for your graphics card. Looks like it's got some metal housing on it to support your graphics card there. And then we've got a PCIe 3.0 by 16 slot here. And we've got three PCIe 3.0 by one slots right in here. And of course, we've got our B550 chipset here as well. So coming across the bottom here, you've got your four pin fan two connector. You've got front USB 2.0 connectors, a four pin fan three connector. You've got two Aura addressable Gen 2 headers as well as an RGB header, a four pin right there. And you've got your Thunderbolt header right up in this area. 
Now, if we jump right up into here, we've got the four pin fan connector. We've got an AIO pump connector, and then we've got our TPM header as well here. Let's jump over and have a look at the IO area. So we've got our IO cover here that gets installed once we assemble our PC. I'll put it on here for your reference. So you can kind of see what's going on. There's a BIOS flashback button up here for updating your BIOS. And then we've got four USB ports. You can see the one has a rectangle around it. That's for updating your BIOS as well. But four USB ports here, two of them, the black ones are USB 2.0. And then the two blue ones are USB 3.2 Gen 1. We've got two USB 3.2 Gen 2s here. One is a type A and one is a type C. We've also got a 2.5G Ethernet port here, and then we've got two USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports. We've got our DisplayPort adapter, an HDMI port, as well as our Wi-Fi 6 connector here for our antenna that came with this. We've got five audio jacks and an optical out port. So that's the I.O. area on this motherboard. Really nice motherboard, I'm quite impressed with it. Not as much flash in here if you're looking for RGB, that sort of thing, but really good build on here. I'm quite excited to put this PC together. And again, this is the ASUS Tough Gaming B550 plus Wi-Fi 2 gaming motherboard. So I hope this closer look at the ASUS Tough Gaming B550 Plus Wi-Fi 2 motherboard gave you value. If it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and remember to subscribe here on YouTube. And YouTube thinks you should watch this video up here next. So why don't you check that one out? Until next time, thanks for watching and take care.